Okay guys, here we are now at the main courtyard of the castle. Look at this. Here you can see bullet holes in this kind of abandoned building. Hello guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. And today I'm riding with my sister and my father. They're of course on my father's bike, on the Honda. My sister is a pillion. And today we'll be visiting a castle, which is, I don't know, one hour away, something like that. Or, yeah, something like that, 45 minutes, I don't know now exactly. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's uh, Sunday today, so it should be a nice uh, weekend ride. Normally, I only I only uh, ride on week during the week on weekdays to avoid the traffic, but uh, I didn't have that much free time, so um, yeah, I went. We will do it on uh, Sunday for a change, and also this castle is open only on Sun on Saturday and Sunday, so during the weekends you can visit the inside, the museum, and the bar and uh, you can order food uh, during the week it's closed so geez, that's a positive but yeah all in all it should be around 130 kilometers three hours probably a bit more for us but yeah doesn't matter should be a nice relaxing uh, ride that everybody enjoys now we're gonna take the the highway first to avoid the traffic of Ljubljana the capital city uh, and yeah as we have the because we have the um, vignette we can use that to avoid these kind of situations so we don't have to spend time in in traffic and yeah after that we will be riding on some on some normal scenic roads again so yeah really looking forward to today's ride so let's go Okay, we're nearly here at the castle. Such a busy road today. That's exactly why I try to avoid riding on weekends because yeah, there's just so many people on the road. Especially if I planned to to go somewhere off-road. There were prob there would be probably many people walking and everything, so yeah, I tried to ride during weekdays. Okay, what is this now here? A settlement? Ah, I can see it already there. The castle. Castle Turiak. Where can we park? possible to go up here should be right yeah let's climb here oof look at this oh many bikers <laughs> many cars look at this three bikers <sighs> ah here we can't park and now they have open. Normally they have closed during the week, but now it's open. The castle 
Turiak. Turiak Castle. we decided to go on a quick tour in the museum as well. I think it was 17 euros for us because we're a family. So let's see quickly what it's like, what it was, what it was like to live here. It looks interesting in the first room already. The underground. Knight's armor. Full body. Rosamunda of Turiak, a painting. It was part of a famous piece of poetry written by the one of the most famous poets here in Slovenia, Francet Rosiena. Now we're in the night hall. It's pretty massive. I think you can rent it for 1,700 euros for five hours to have something here inside, I don't know, a party or whatever. Whatever you can have here. Some more nights. Cans. Words. And this guy. These guns. This kind of weapons for the real deal. Hunter's room. With all the bears and the heads, skulls, or what, the, what are they called? out again alive and now the lunch bon appetit great place to have lunch okay guys here we are now at the main courtyard of the castle look at this Here you can see bullet holes in this kind of abandoned building. So the bullet holes are because during the Second World War 
1943 the Parkinsons uh, have taken over this castle after a long battle with the Blue Guard which were which was a part of the Slovene uh, Chetniks which was a anti-communist um, militia back during the during the war and yeah this was these are all scars from the battle uh, yeah from that time basically but um and I wanted to say yeah so this castle is from the 13th century first mentioned uh in the 13th century and yeah, they say it was built even before that in the 12th or the 11th century and yeah it's a pretty pretty massive massive uh, and important castle here in this area um, it was attacked by the by the Ottomans two times but they got repelled both times they were they were not successful and it was uh, completely destroyed during a uh, what's it called a earthquake earthquake yeah, it was completely destroyed and rebuilt again and then of course during the second world war you can still see that it wasn't completely uh, renovated yet but it was quite it's, it was uh, renovated quite a bit, as you can see, practically perfect now, so yeah, it's getting pretty windy and cloudy, but yeah, thankfully it's now, uh, there are uh, very warm temperature now, so at least that's something positive. Here we go, this is the castle. Let's take a look at the view. The last time now you can walk down here then if you want. And there's the I think the ruins of the old castle. This was also a, a part of it. At least it looks like that. Okay, let's continue. Now we have another one and a half hour, one and a half hours to home. So let's go. All right, guys, we are ready to continue today's today's uh, ride. Yeah, now we have. One hour and thirty minutes to the to home, and it should be a nice, enjoyable ride. At least I hope so. Many bikers on the road today. Okay, let's go. All right. So, as I already said, let's go. guys we're pretty much at home so I'm gonna end the video here my father and sister are somewhere behind I don't know where they are they went on a sep on a separate route somewhere some time ago already so they're probably still behind but yeah it was the warmest day today so far this year 26 degrees 
at least while I was on the road and many many bikers so many bikers I haven't seen seen yeah since last year <laughs> so many people because it's Sunday of course there's a lot more traffic people go uh, on day trips yeah but it was interesting um, interesting uh, the whole castle is pretty massive and also the scenery in the places we ridden we normally ride past them on the, on the highway so it was nice to to uh, see them see them uh, differently than only from the highway now it's also looking like it's going to rain cloudy even though it's not in the forecast but yeah thankfully we're done for today already so if you enjoyed the video you can give me a like subscribe to the channel if you want to see more and yeah thank you for watching see you in the next video bye